Yeah, man, it's crazy, man, on everything, man. What I want y'all to do is I want to make sure, yo, drink water. <laughs> drink water. It's brutal out here, man. I don't want to see nobody, man, down. Lord Brunson back at you with the back at you, and I'm the best reporting on the Eagles. Before we get into the meat and potatoes, I got to let you know that Monday, midnight, tonight, the album is dropping, joint project, myself, D'Angelo Xavier, Days on York, nights, nights in Norfolk, you know what I mean? It's going down, you know what I'm saying? Um, six tracks, just just pure lyricism, you know what I mean? Giving it up how we give it up, you know what I'm saying? Um, Low-key got some as a hit single, man, and it, it's thanks to y'all, man. That joint been jumping out of the gym on Spotify, man. We now up to closely... Uh, close around 5,000 monthly listeners, man. You know what I mean? And that's just all of dedication and hard work. So shout out to y'all, man. Also, this video was brought to you by Mando. It's hot out here, man. You do not want to be out here stanking. You don't want to be out here stanking. I'm already looking like some glazed ribs. I've only been out here 10 minutes to make this video. It's hot. Tapping with Mando, deodorant, body wash, everything. Wipes for the sack. Everything, man. Use the code in the description, man. Big Mando is going to take care of you. Listen, man, all the back and forth with Jalen Hurts, you know what I mean, and, and Nick Sirianni, how, how people are perceiving the two's relationship is kind of wild to me, man, because this article drops on Bleacher Report uh, today, actually, saying that Jalen Hurts is being given the free reign as the man of the center. And that free reign is being given to him by Kellen Moore, by Nick Sirianni. So this year, you know what I mean, as a starter for Jalen Hurst, expect more control. Expect things to make more sense. You know what I mean? I think this is Nick Sirianni, in a sense, trying to wash his hands of it. You know what I mean? Trying to be blame free. But that's what you're supposed to do. That's what you're supposed to do if you ask me, man. Listen, man, listen. Put it in the hands of your guy who get in the bag. Put it in the hands of your guy who's been there before. That way it don't fall back on you. We talked about this in so many instances, man. In so many instances, we talked about this. How guys can protect themselves by just letting other people do their job. That's it. And I'm all for that. If, that, if that. if that's the approach for Nick Sirianni this year, let other people do their job. You know what I mean? So others can be evaluated. I think Nick had his hands in a pot too much. But being as though I, I trust Jalen Hurts getting more control. So it don't bother me. You know what I mean? I like how this is panning out. I like how this is shaping up. So, you know, um, it, it is what it is, man. I like it, man. And, and I hope this hushes some of the rumors of, of the rift between Jalen and Nick Sirianni. I hope it does. I really, really do. You know what I mean? So the rest of this video, we're going to be talking about um, Milton Williams, man. We're going to talk about, I think Milton Williams is elite. I think Milton Williams is an elite specimen on the football field. You know what I mean? Just a guy who really hasn't had the opportunity to show everybody what he really made of, in my opinion, because he didn't really get a lot of time on the field. Milton Williams has flashed more than Jordan Davis, more than Mozzie Smith, more than a lot of guys within the division and in the NFL when it's been right under our nose the whole time. I think Milton Williams is poised for a contract extension probably middle of the year. Probably middle of the year, the Philadelphia Eagles will extend Milton Williams, man. That role is getting increased without Fletcher Cox. And these are some of the things on tape that I feel that Milton Williams has, you know, exceeded at. And these are some of the things that I see on tape from Milton Williams that says that, you know, he should be definitely getting more playing time. I have been extremely bullish on Milton Williams for years now at this point. And I think that this is the year Milton Williams gets a contract extension with the Philadelphia Eagles based upon some of the elite attributes that he's already shown with very, very limited playing time, man. Here you see Milton Williams showing a rare combination of speed and power. But what I like the most about Milton Williams is that he is excellent at stopping the run. He's excellent at standing up a would-be blocker and still being able to diagnose where the runner is going to go and lunge into that hole and create traffic. Um, he did it at the highest levels in the Super Bowl. You know, um, he, he does it almost every time he's on the field. And the thing about Milton Williams that... That, that This is what bothers me about the Philadelphia Eagles. You know, sometimes you draft players high, and then sometimes you have players that outperform them. You know, I think we need to just say what it is, man. Right now at this juncture behind Jalen Carter, Milton Williams is the best defensive lineman that you got, you know what I mean, in terms of guys that play the outside. Now, I, I like Jordan Davis' size. I like his upside, and you, you know, and what he does. But Milton Williams is extremely explosive. 
You know what I mean? If, if if Jordan Davis was performing like how Milton Williams is on the defensive interior, then we'd be talking about Jordan Davis being some type of all-pro future Hall of Famer. I think that Milton Williams can be as great as Fletcher Cox was if we give him more playing time. I think it's up to the Philadelphia Eagles to understand that, man. You know, you have – you have Milton Williams is elite. I'm going to tell you right now, he's elite. You know what I mean? He's elite diagnosing screens – all type of stuff. This is an elite defensive interior presence that the Philadelphia Eagles have. And, you know, with Fletcher Cox out the picture, it's time now for the Philadelphia Eagles to, you know, give Milton Williams some more on his plate. You know what I mean? He shows up, he performs. He shows up and he performs. And he understands the depth chart. He understands where he is. You know what I mean? Even double teams. This this uh, film came from Fran Duffy. Uh, this is from week one. But even even double teams right here, man, you know, still being able to stand up to it. And that was, was that Trent? Still being able to stand up two guys, you know what I'm saying, and still make a play. What do the Philadelphia Eagles value? Do you outvalue names and draft picks? Or are you going to value... You know what I mean? The guys that's getting it done. Just a conversation to have.